Hey guys, welcome back. So this is video 23 in the Windows Server 2022 playlist. And the next couple of videos, we're gonna wrap up this playlist, but we're gonna do a few tickets. So say for example, in this case, we, we are using Spiceworks for our ticketing system, because it's free and it was easy to set up. So we just went with that. You can use any ITSM setup, uh, whatever you prefer, but if you're following along, we're using Spiceworks. So this is, we get a call from Val. Val is locked out of her machine and we wanna go ahead and reset her password and unlock her account. So she can't log into her machine. She called up the help desk or she called us up and we're gonna check that out in a second. So we're gonna go ahead and troubleshoot and get her work and make sure she's able to log in and she's good to go. But before we get into the video, before we get into the servers, please, Remember to like, subscribe, share, and hopefully you guys are enjoying this playlist as much as I am. So, and if you are new to the channel, welcome. If you're returning, thank you so much and uh, continue supporting the channel. I really appreciate it. Okay, so now we have Val. Ring, ring, ring. This is Val. And I'm, I'm the help desk or the sysadmin and I'm remoted into her machine for an example. And I say, okay, Val, go ahead and put your password in. Let's see what you get. And okay, whatever. Let's go ahead and put the password in. And it says, your account has been disabled. Please contact your system administrator. Okay, Val, give me a moment. Let me work on this. And uh, we'll get this working, right? So me as a sysadmin, we'll go into the backend servers. All right, so before we do that, let's go look at this, the ticketing server. Right, so let's make this a little bigger. That's really big. So we have a ticket here. Reset password for Val, but she's she's logged out. She's locked out and everything. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and add some some notes. We are working on the ticket. We will contact you ASAP. When it's fixed. Okay, and then we'll send this over to Val and let's go ahead and work on the ticket. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to our Active Directory server. These tickets shouldn't take very long to do. We're just doing basic uh, troubleshooting, basic stuff. I'm not going to be doing 20 minute videos for, for these. These are probably going to be five to five minutes at most. Uh, and I'm just going to show you guys how to troubleshoot it and what we can do as a sysadmin or a help desk to get the user back into the machine working, making sure everything is good to go. All right, so let's go into Active Directory. Where's my AP? It's right here. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and look for Val. We can just go ahead, you know, if this was a huge AD, but obviously patience, go ahead and find, let's go ahead and we're gonna find, uh, let's give it some time because I am running a few servers. Let's look for Val. We can see here that Val is disabled. As you see, like this little uh, down arrow here, if we right click, we can enable account. Okay. And then we're going to also reset her password. Okay. So let me go ahead and reset her password. Okay, unlock the user's account. Perfect, we changed her password. And now let's go to HR, refresh this. Now she doesn't have that little down arrow. So she should be good at this time. But now we can call Val back and say, okay, Val, go ahead and try to log in now. See if you're able to log in. Okay, so now Val is gonna try and log in. So far, so good. She's able to log in, but we'll give that a moment. Make sure she's good. Okay, Val, make sure you can get on the internet. Let's make sure Val can get on the internet. Let's go to Google. Let's 
We'll give that a moment. Okay, Val is able to browse the internet. And the next thing, we're gonna make sure Val can get to her network drives. And let's go to this computer, this PC, and let's make sure she can get to our home directory, and she can. So it looks like she's good. Open up, thanks. And I'm gonna put, thank you for all your help and support. All right, so that pretty much concludes this video. If I'm looking at the timer, it's about five minutes. So exactly what I thought, it's about five to seven minute video. So this is pretty much how you can reset and enable a user that calls you with a disabled account and they can't log into their operating system. So hopefully this, hopefully, hopefully this has been informative. But before we let you go, remember, like, subscribe, share, and all that good stuff. But let's go ahead and close out the ticket because Val was able to come in. Let's go ahead and close this out. And now it's closed. Now, if we go to close tickets, we can see Val, it's closed. We were all good. And let's go ahead and send that. And we should be good. So this is pretty much a ticketing system, how we set up the ticketing system, how we put in tickets. And you have these ads because they're, it's free. But yeah, hopefully it's been informative for you folks. Thank you so much for viewing. And until next time, have a beautiful day. Thank you.